Hey guys, we just wanted to tell you about our new merch. What? We have new merch? Are you serious? Yeah, and it's so cuddly and adorable. Wait a minute. Do we have unicorns? <laughs> Daisy, of course we don't have unicorns. But we do have snugglers. What? They're adorable. Snugglers are your adorable, squeezy, cuddly friend. I want them, Molly. They're so cute. We also have backpacks and t-shirts. You guys can check it out by going to starsquad.shop. Now it's time to get to the video. <laughs> that was the saddest movie I've ever seen. How the raccoon got abandoned by its mom and all. Oh. Yeah, but Molly, at the end, the raccoon got a new family. That was so nice. I don't know. I think a movie about raccoons is a little well made up. How can you say that, Brookie? Raccoons are people, too. Uh, Molly, raccoons are people, though. Animals, you know? Some people call them trash pandas. <laughs> That's funny. How can you guys laugh? Laugh at a time like this. It was the saddest movie ever. Did you guys hear that we're supposed to get a huge snowstorm today? Um, well, then you probably shouldn't be wearing shorts. <laughs> You're probably right. I guess summer's over. Summer's been over for like three months, Brookie. I know, but I'm always like running around and stuff, so I get really hot, so I just wear shorts until it snows. Then it's just a no-go. Um, Molly, you're wearing pajamas. Yeah, when I'm at home, I wear my pajamas all the time because it's like so comfy. And I'm cozy and warm and stuff. Yeah, um, my brothers, they keep stealing my pajama bottoms because we're like the same size. Oh, man, that stinks. Yeah, they never want to do their laundry, so they just steal my pajamas. Oh, that's a bummer. Yeah, having brothers is so annoying. Try having all sisters. It'll drive you crazy. Whatever, Molly. I'm the best sister ever. Crazy. Bonkers. Looney Tunes. Molly, knock it off. Seriously. But for reals, I always thought it would be so cool to have a brother. Well, trust me, it's not as cool as you think. Whoa, it looks kind of stormy outside. I think it's going to start snowing any minute. Look, Brookie, you were right. It's a blizzard out here. Brr, it's freezing. Brookie, are you going to spend the night? Actually, I probably should get home. I mean, if if it's that bad out. No, it's, it's, uh, you can't go home. You're stuck here. Seriously, it's a blizzard. Well, I guess I'm spending the night. Do you have any pajamas I could borrow? Sure, no problem. You should call your mom, though, and tell her you're staying here. Good idea, Molly. Mom? Yes, Brookie, where are you? There's a huge snowstorm going on. Um, I came, for, came over to Molly and Daisy's house, and I'm kind of stuck here. Is that okay? Yes, honey, just stay there so you're safe. Okay, Mom, well, um, can you come pick me up in the morning? As soon as the plows come through, sweetie, I'll come get you. Okay, bye, Mom. Bye, honey. Is she okay with you spending the night? Um, yeah, she totally is. I better ask my mom. Mom? What's up? Oh, my. It's so snowing out right now. Yeah, it's like a blizzard out there. Brookie, you definitely have to spend the night. Good thing she already called her mom and said she was. <laughs> okay, well, let's get you some warm pajama bottoms. Those shorts just aren't what you do in this weather. Yeah, exactly. Can we go outside and play? Um, Molly, it looks like a blizzard out there. I think you should stay inside. Okay, fine. I just want to go out here for one minute, Mom. Holy guacamole. Look at all the snow. All of Brookhaven is covered. We must have a foot of snow already in like ten minutes. It's beginning to look a lot like no school for at least a week. Hooray! There's no homework and I get to hang out with my friend. I love when it snows. <laughs> Molly, you're so silly. I am loving no school. I'm going to cry because I'm going to miss school so much. Oh, seriously, Daisy, take a break. Take a chill pill from school. All right, girls. Well, who wants popcorn? We could watch a movie. I do. I do. Okay, well, I've got some work to do, but I'll make you some popcorn. You guys pick the movie. Well, we already watched the one about the raccoon. Um, eh, uh, no, no, no. 
Ooh, Cops is on. Ooh, I love Cops. Cops and popcorn sounds like a great blizzard activity. Okay, don't hog all the popcorn. Don't worry, Molly. I'm making enough for everyone. How come Brookie got hers first? Because, Molly, she's our guest. Mmm, this popcorn's delicious. Yeah, you could say that again. Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Daisy, don't sing. You're making my ears hurt. Molly, try to be nice to your sister. I am, Brookie, I am! Girls, I'll be upstairs working in my office. Okay, we'll be down here scarfing down a bunch of popcorn. <laughs> was that your stomach growling, Brookie? No, was it yours? No. It's probably Daisy's brain making noise about science. Molly, you can't heal someone's brain. Actually, your mouth is talking right now, and that was used that used your brain. What? What are you even talking about? Help me. There's that sound again. What could that be? Please help. Ah! There's a guy outside, and he looks like he's freezing to death. Oh my gosh. I know. There's a lot of snow. It's coming down. It's a blizzard. Come inside our house. Molly, he might be a murderer. You don't just invite anybody in. I'm not. I'm a, 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 a murderer. Yeah, he's just a frozen dude at our door. Wait, why are you a frozen dude at our door? I walked so many miles. Um, okay. So, it's okay. You can say it. Molly, he's trying. You, I better go start a fire. That, that might warm him up some. G good idea. Okay, so why are you at our door? I... I am... What? Your... What's a... Um, Molly, I think he said your brother. <laughs> I don't have a brother. What are you talking about? I, I'm your brother. He's not saying brother. Okay, Daisy, uh, what are you doing? I can't get it to stop. Jeepers. Well, that wasn't so hard, was it? Hey, Frozen Dude, come over here. I've got a nice warm fire for you. Come on. Okay, I can't move. My knees are frozen. Oh, oh, that's much better. Oh, oh look. He's not quite as blue anymore, is he? No, Molly, he still looks pretty blue. It's going to take a few minutes for him to heat up. But I'm serious, Molly. I think he did say he was your brother. Well, he's sadly mistaken. His brain must have gotten frozen then. Because, um, I don't have a brother. Oh, look, he's not blue anymore. He's kind of changing all sorts of colors. Are you okay? Oh, I'm feeling much better now. Oh, there. You okay? Gosh, I probably almost killed you from frostbite. Yeah, thanks for that. I, I, I found out just, well, this morning... I've been looking for a really long time for you and Daisy. You have? Why? Did I fail my math test? Are you the math police? You don't smell like you've taken a bath in a week. That's because I've been doing a lot of research. And I've been staying up a lot of late nights. Well, if you need a bath, there's one upstairs. Daisy, you might want to back up if he smells bad. Hey. Oh, it's okay. I wouldn't expect anything less from my sisters. Did you just say sisters? He did, Molly. That's right. I just I just got the records this morning. And I walked here because the blizzard, you know, and, and my car wouldn't go in the snow. But I found out I'm your long-lost brother. Dun, dun, dun! Is this dramatic or what? If you think so, hit that like button. Seriously, Molly? You're using this as some way for someone to hit the like button on, on YouTube? Of course I am! Our fans know everything about our lives! And, 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 and it's shocking to think I have a long-lost brother! How do you know this? I know that I was born with two sisters who got adopted, and I wasn't. And and I remember my little sisters. And, and one had red hair, and, and one had blonde hair. And I just know you and Daisy are my sisters. What? I have an older brother. I always wanted one of those. Remember what I said, Molly. Be careful what you wish for. Older brothers are the pits. Uh, I'm a good older brother. Well, I mean, I think I am. I, I, I never was around you guys, but 
But I think I will be. I, I make a really good grilled cheese. Really? Because I'm starving. You can come into the kitchen with me right now and prove how good of a brother you are. Molly! What? He offered and I'm hungry. It's okay, Molly. I'll make you a toasted cheese. Toasted cheese? Did you just call it a toasted cheese? Oh my gosh! It's a grilled cheese! Who are you even? This guy says he's our brother. I'm not sure that I could actually believe that. Possible fire detected at your house. What are you doing, Daisy? I'm proving that he is not our brother. But, um, I think we have bigger problems! There's a fire in our house! Ah! Call the fire department! Help! Help! Nobody panic! I'm a trained firefighter! And also, here's your toasted cheese. Oh my gosh, my entire house is on fire! Ah! Okay, nobody panic! I'm gonna put this out right now! Alright, um, you guys should go outside, though. Out into the blizzard? Yes, and it's safer out there, at least. Brookie, are you coming? No, he's got the fire out. I'm, I think everybody's okay. I'm not leaving my science research. It's on this computer. Are you sure everything's okay, Brookie? I don't know. I, I think so. I'm going back in to make sure. Is everything okay? Wait, did you even tell us your name? It's Levi. Oh, thanks, Levi. You're a really good older brother. Aha! You're not a brother, Levi. Wait, what? But I, I did all the research. You are my sisters and I'm your brother yeah what are you talking about Daisy don't be rude to Levi he just she just saved our house um well uh Daisy I just want to tell you that your booty is hanging out what yeah why don't you um become my plumber or something Molly that's not very nice well I'm just telling you your booty is hanging out oh uh, whoops <laughs> I guess this um these pants are a little too small yeah you think so Daisy's got a big booty. Molly, be quiet. Okay, fine. Everybody's always telling me to be quiet. So why isn't Levi our brother? Well, it says Levi was adopted from Blacksburg Adoption Center. We were never at the Blacksburg Adoption Center. We were at Brookhaven Adoption Center. But, but that doesn't mean anything. Uh, yes, because we were siblings pale and we were adopted at the same time as all of our siblings. Well, except for baby Kira. My parents had her later. Oh, so you guys aren't my long lost sisters? No. Sorry, Levi. Oh, no. I thought I had finally found some family. <laughs> oh, man, I feel so bad for Levi. I'm gonna go see him. Levi, are you pooping? No, I'm just crying. Okay, well then I can come in. Um, oh man, you look so sad. I just really thought you guys were my family. You know what, Levi? If you don't find your family, or even if you do, you can still come hang out with us. You're a nice guy. Really? I don't have anywhere to go on Thanksgiving. Really? Nowhere? No, I don't have a family. Well... I'm sure you can have Thanksgiving with us. Seriously? Yeah. Besides, if my dad cooks the turkey, we're going to need you here because he'll definitely try burning our house down. <laughs> oh, Molly, that's the nicest thing you've ever said. Yeah, but can we get out of the bathroom and talk about this out there? Because it smells like a little bit of a stinky doo-doo in here. Oh, sorry. I kind of farted. Hey, maybe you are my long-lost brother. I fart all the time. <laughs> See? Just like that. <laughs> I fart too. <laughs> we have a lot in common. Totally. Well, I'm playing Roblox and Bookie's playing Roblox too. So, uh, you guys want to play some Roblox? Yeah. How about you, Levi? I love Roblox. Are you guys noobs though? No, we're not noobs. Okay, DZ. Um, maybe we should play that Doors game. That looked really creepy. I don't know. A creepy game? Are you guys old enough? Yeah. We have a YouTube channel. You want to see it? I totally do. You guys are kind of like my adopted sisters. Daisy, are you ever going to, like, go put on different pants? Seriously. I will in a minute. I'm playing Roblox. <laughs> uh, mm, something smells delicious. I wonder what it could be. Oh, wait. It's the weekend, so my mom's probably making something delicious for breakfast. 
Oh, look at baby Kira. She's still sleeping. Oh, she looks so adorable in her little crib. Oh, sweet little baby sister. Until she wakes up and then she's kind of loud. Good morning, Molly. Hey, watch where you're going. You almost ran into me. Okay, girls, let's not be grumpy first thing in the morning. Who's grumpy? I'm not grumpy. It was Molly. And no fighting either. Hey, that's my chair. That, that's my chair. Molly, just sit in the chair next to her. I don't want to sit next to her. She smells. Molly! Seriously? You're going to be annoying already? Hey, Mom, what's this guacamole? <laughs> well, you said you love guacamole so much. I thought maybe I'd make you some for breakfast. <laughs> Molly has to eat guacamole. <laughs> I'm not going to eat guacamole on my pancakes. Mm, these are good. So delicious. Good morning, baby Kira. Wake up. Mama, hi. Hi, baby Kira. Come on, let's go downstairs. You can have a baba. Okay, sweetheart. Let's sit in a chair and eat some of your guacamole. Molly, actually, that's baby food. I wouldn't make guacamole for breakfast. <laughs> Molly, you're going to dip your pancakes in it. No, I wasn't. Uh, let's see. Bottle, bottle, bottle. I want bottle! I eat bottle! Hold on, it's coming, baby Kira. Oh my gosh, you can't explain to a baby when they're hungry that it's going to take a minute because they get really mean. Um, ooh, you ate this. <laughs> well, I haven't drank a bottle in a long time, but I remember when I was a baby, I loved bottles. Molly, you still love food. It's like your favorite thing ever. Well... She's got a point there. Mmm, these pancakes are delicious, Mom. Hey, Mom, when's Dad coming home? Well, he's not going to be home until tomorrow morning. Ah, oh, these business meetings. I know, I kind of miss him. I mean, he always has some sort of silly dad joke to tell us. Yeah, they're so cheesy. So him. Yeah, I miss him too. Don't eat that, it's guacamole! Don't tell your sister that. She'll spit it out. I like guacamole. <laughs> Come on, baby Kira, let's go play. Aw, oh, look it, you have Kitty McKittums. Uh, Molly, you're a little too big to be inside the playpen. Nonsense. <laughs> this is the perfect place to be on a Saturday morning with my baby sister. I bet the kitty meow, meow, meow. I, I can go to school soon and then I can learn my ABCs. Um, no, you can't go to school soon. You're too little. I can't go. You can't say I can't go to school. Oh, no. She's going to cry. Way to go, Molly. You made her cry. Okay, you can go to school someday when you're a big girl. I pick her now. Ew, something smell bad. What? What are you talking about? Do you have a dirty diaper? No, you have a dirty diaper. Me? Molly, when was the last time you took a bath? Oh, um, uh... Molly, the whole room stinks. Do you need your diaper changed? Who, me? No! <laughs> Perhaps you should go take a bath because then we have to go to the store. I am getting low on diapers and formula. Oh, a trip to the store. Can I get some candy? Um, we'll see, Molly, but first... P.U., go take a shower. Okay, fine. Everybody's complaining. I mean, I took a shower last week. I don't know why they're so grumpy. Maybe I'll read a book while I'm in the tub. And at least I'll have something to do. La, 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 ah. Actually, taking a bath is kind of nice. It's just like relaxing on a Saturday. Ah. Molly, get out of there. Your sister needs a bath. Mom, I just got in. Sorry, but you have to take a quick one. She needs to take a bath, and then we have to go to the store. Fine. Relaxation over. I love bass. I love bass. Okay, Papa. Papa. Okay, baby Kara. It's time to get out of the tub. No, I don't want you. Hey, quit kicking. Quick. Ah, you're getting me soaked. Oh my gosh, baby Kara, you're being such a brat right now. Here, um, just sit right here, and um, I'm gonna go get a towel. I can move around a lot. Okay, you can move around a lot. Here, let's just get you dried off. Because then we're going to go to the store, okay? I'm clean now. Aw, I know you're clean now. Come on, let's go. You are the cutest little baby in the world. Even if you are an annoying sister sometimes. 
Daisy, why are you brushing your teeth at the sink? My toothbrush was down here, so I just decided to use it. Girls, are you ready? Come on, let's get going to the store. I get front seat. Molly, you always get front seat. That's so rude. Molly, all right, fine. Your sister Daisy gets to sit in the front on the way back. I get in the back. I'm a baby. I get in my car seat. That's right, and I get to sit here with you, I guess. What, there's nothing wrong with sitting with baby Kira. She's so adorable, right? If everyone could just get along on this Saturday, that would be perfect. Wow, look at all the leaves. They've changed and it looks beautiful. I couldn't agree more. Fun is my favorite time of year. Especially since Thanksgiving is right around the corner. It's making my stomach growl just thinking about it. Of course it is, Molly. That's all you think about is your stomach, stomach, stomach. Which is a good thing we're going to the grocery store then, right, Molly? <laughs> Mom, you know me so perfectly. Mom, where are you going? This is just a little shortcut. Hang on. OMG, Mom. And um, don't tell your father. <laughs> Mom, you're driving like a maniac. Well, she said it's a shortcut. Mm, and that's definitely a shortcut. Except for the fact there's no road, Mom. Whee! <laughs> I, I realized that ramp was there the other day. Mom, you are cray cray. But she's right, we got here super fast. Here we are, BFF Supermarket. Mom, can I get some candy? Uh, I don't know, Molly, we'll see if it's on sale. Mom, can I push the cart? Sure, Molly, if you must, I guess you can. These carts are stuck. Ugh, why are these carts stuck? I hate when I go to the grocery store and the carts are stuck. Uh, uh, uh. Molly, just, just, okay, there you go, you got it. Let baby Kara sit in the front seat, okay? Mom, there's no seat in this one. Seriously? Oh, that's so annoying. Okay, that's fine. I'll just carry her. Mom, do we need some beans? Absolutely. I could make some chili. It's supposed to be cold this week. And get some apples. Ooh, apples and grapes and... Whoa, the price of everything has gone up by a million percent. Yeah, that's just the way of the world, Molly. Just be grateful that we can afford to get groceries this week. Yeah, Mom, I'm really grateful for that. Um, Mom, I, I saw that they're doing a food drive at school with canned goods um, for Thanksgiving. Do you think we could get an extra couple of cans? Absolutely, Molly. That's really thoughtful. I love that you thought of that. Go ahead and get some extra juice and some cans of fruit and things for um, the food drive. Okay, Mom, um, and since I was so nice, can I also have these potato chips? Wait a minute. Is that you just trying to butter me up so you could get some potato chips? No, I'd never do that. Wait, why is Daisy in the car? She didn't want to come in. Really? Why? She said that you get kind of crazy at the grocery store. I do not! Can I have some candy? Molly, you already got the potato chips. I don't think you need candy and potato chips. Mom! Oh! This is exactly what your sister was talking about with you getting crazy at the grocery store. Now, baby Kira and I have to go to the baby aisle and get some diapers and formula. Try not to put candy in the in the cart, Molly. Me? Put candy in the cart? <laughs> I wouldn't do that. Yes, I would. Yes, I would. Last one to the car is a rotten egg. I'll wrap you rotten egg. I'll wrap you rotten egg. <laughs> you guys are a rotten egg. Molly, get out of the driver's seat. You're not driving. Fine. Mom, it's my turn to be in the front seat, remember? Well, um, let's see who gets there first. <laughs> me! Molly! Oh, you drive me crazy, Molly. I did but, but I love Molly. See? The verdict's out. Maybe Kira loves me. I just wish you two could get along for one day on the weekend, because I seriously need a break from your arguing. On second thought, I need a break. You guys stay out here and watch baby Kira. I'm going to get my nails done. Mom, you didn't even park in a parking spot. Close enough. Now what are we going to do? I guess we could sing a song. Muck. Yeah. Ing. Yeah. Bird. Molly, I think we should sing a Christmas carol. You're driving me crazy. All right, fine. Pick one. Jingle bell, jingle bells. Ooh, that's a great one, baby Kira. Let's sing that. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. 
Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Hey! Feeling better, Mom? Yeah, so much. All right, girls, what do you say we go home and watch a movie? Baby Kira needs to take a nap. Oh, boy, take a nap. No! Yes, Baby Kira, you're taking a nap. All right, Baby Kira, let's first give you a diaper change. You smell a little stinky. I want to take a nap. I want to watch a movie. No, everybody knows you get grumpy if you don't have your nap because you're still a little baby. Oh, come on, sweetie. La, la, la. La, la, la. La, la, la. La, la, la. la. Have a good sleep, sweetheart. Hmm, what's for lunch? I'm starving. Ooh, pizza, Reese cups. Hmm, oh, there's lots of delicious stuff in here. I want to get it out all over the counter and see exactly what I want to eat today. Molly, did you just make this big mess everywhere? I'm trying to clean the house. Sorry, Mom, I'm just looking for a snack I want to eat. Well, why did you have to pull everything out of the fridge in order to see what you wanted to eat? Um, because my eyes are as big as my stomach. Molly, please pick it all up. I'm trying to vacuum. This house is a mess. Since I'm the only one that seems to want to vacuum, I can put it away as soon as I, um, as soon as I mm, pick what I want to eat. Molly, you're making a huge mess. Look, now there's stuff on that counter. Ugh. Okay, I'll just go vacuum somewhere else. Um, honey, do you think you could take care of the laundry and fold it? Honey, you're right in front of this TV show. I love this show. Honey, it's a puppy and a kitten. Since when do you like shows about puppies and kittens? Since right now. This is adorable. I'm sorry, honey. I can't fold the laundry right now. I gotta watch this. Fine, I guess I'll do it. Ugh, does anyone want to help me around here at all? Thanks for moving out of the way. Oh my gosh, this is such a cute episode. Daisy, since I vacuumed and did all this laundry, do you think you could um, do the dishes since it's your turn, please? Sorry, Mom. I just finished this amazing report on puppies, and now I need to go outside and get some fresh air. See you later. Daisy, it's your turn to do the dishes. When does Mom get a break? When do I get a break? From cleaning and doing everyone's laundry and, and dishes and it's not fair. Whoa, Mom, what's wrong with you? I, I, I just, I feel like I need a break. <laughs> Mom, you should know better. Moms don't get breaks. Oh my gosh, I, 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 I don't even know what to say. Well, um, you probably don't have a lot to say because you got to go fold all that laundry. Fine, just, 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 just don't even talk to me. Okay, Mom. Well, Mom? Uh, <laughs> she probably had to go outside and um, plant some new flowers or something. She's always doing some sort of work. Molly, can you keep it down over there? I'm trying to watch this puppy and kitten episode. Ooh, this looks amazing. I'll watch it too. Ah, life is good. Ah, my stomach's starting to growl. What time is it? Whoa, six o'clock? We were supposed to have dinner a half an hour ago. No wonder my stomach's growling. Honey, when's dinner? No answer. Hmm. I wonder what's gotten into your mother. I don't know. I'll go check. She's probably making a huge Thanksgiving dinner for us, even though it's not even Thanksgiving. Mom's cool like that. Mom? Mom? Dinner's not even started. Where's Mom? What? What do you mean, where's Mom? She's in the kitchen making a dinner. No, she's not. She's not in there. Hmm. Maybe she ordered us a pizza or something. She's probably up still folding laundry. Mom! Are you scrubbing the toilet? No? Ew! The toilet's gross. It hasn't even gotten scrubbed yet. Maybe she's in my room. Mom? Maybe she's in Baby Kira's room. Oh, yeah. Baby Kira's spending the day with Grandma. That's right. I forgot about that. Um, no. She's not in Baby Kira's room. She's nowhere up here. Where could she be? Guys, Mom is nowhere in the house. Well, go look outside. She's probably out there. Mom! Wait, is that a note down there? What? What's that say? It's a letter from Mom. 
Dear family, I'm tired of doing it all without any help. I can't do this anymore where I never get a break. So I'm taking one. I have run away. Run away? But, 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 but well, who will do the laundry? Who will vacuum? Who will make us turkey dinner? Dad! Ma! Uh, Dad! Ma! Ma! Mom! Mom ran away! What? Quit your pranking, Molly. That's rude. No, read this letter. Dear family. What? She, she, she ran away? Did you make this letter up? No, Dad. It's in Mom's handwriting. Look. But, but who will make our dinner and, and, and vacuum and... What are you guys yelling about? Mom ran away! Oh. My. Gosh! Wow, this is a really good episode. Daisy, we have bigger fish to fry than kittens and puppies. What? That didn't make sense. Okay, I, I'm just saying, we have to, we have to, um, we have to figure out how to get Mom back. Who's gonna do all these chores? Molly, I think that's sort of Mom's point. She doesn't want to have to do them all by herself, and she probably won't come back unless we help. Help? But I only watch puppies and kittens. Well, think about it, Dad. When does Mom get to watch puppy and kittens? Oh, wow. I think maybe we've been taking a little advantage of your mom doing all the chores for us. What? Nah. Mom loves doing all that stuff. Uh, Molly, according to this note, not really. Okay, well, let me just try to call her and work this all out. I'm sure it's a big misunderstanding. It's just ringing. And ringing. And ringing. She's not going to pick up. Hi, you've reached Laura, or Mom, <laughs> and I can't come to the phone because I've run away from my responsibilities. So no one wants to help me, and I don't feel like picking up. You can leave me a message, though. Mom, it's Molly, and um, this is just a big misunderstanding, right? Right? Mom, who's going to do all the chores if you've run away? Y you have to come back. Okay, call me back. Bye. I'm sure she'll call me back, right? I don't think she's coming back. She's left us here with all these chores! Well, maybe we can just not do the chores. What? We have to do the chores? I mean, my stomach is growling. Okay, well, Dad, you're another grown-up. You, you make the food. What? I don't know how to make food. Well, you better go try. All right, well, I guess there's a first time for everything. Maybe I could, like, make some pizza or some turkey or... I don't know. I'll just see what's in the fridge and throw it all together in a pot. Dad, you can't throw turkey and pizza in a pot and boil it. That will be gross. Okay, Daisy. Who made you, boss? I didn't even tell you what to do yet. Well, you were going to. Of course I was going to. I'm the older sister, so I get to boss you around. No, you don't, Molly. You don't get to boss me around. Girls, just do some chores, please. All right, I'll vacuum. You do the laundry. Okay, Molly, I guess I can do the laundry. I guess vacuuming isn't so bad. I really miss my mom, though. I didn't realize how much work she actually did around here. Now I feel kind of bad leaving it all up to her. Ugh, ugh, this is a lot of work. Ugh. Dad, how's dinner going? Actually, I don't think I did too bad. Wow, actually, Dad, I think you did pretty good. Daisy, how's dishes going? Oh, wait, no, you're not doing the dishes. You're doing the laundry. Do not put dishes into the washing machine. Duh, Molly, I know that. Well, dinner's ready, Daisy, as soon as you put that in the wash. Dad, this looks scrumptious. Mm, mm. Ew! <laughs> Ew, this tastes gross. What is this? Um, dog food? Dog food? Dad, you can't feed us dog food. But it said real beef. Ew, gross. Daisy, don't eat it. Well, actually, Daisy, you should eat that. It's delicious. Molly, you're not going to try to trick me into eating dog food. Come on, guys. Let's just go to bed. Hopefully, we'll figure something out in the morning. Sounds good to me. I'm not really hungry anymore anyway. Mom? Mom? Mom, are you back yet? Mom? Oh, she didn't come back. Oh, Mom. I'm going to call her. Leave a message after the beep. Beep. Mom, it's Molly, and I just want to say that we really miss you. Not just because you do all the chores, but because we love you. You're our mom, and I hope you come home. I vacuumed, 
Daisy did the laundry and, well, Dad tried to feed us dog food because he's terrible at cooking, but he tried. We promise from now on we'll try to help more, okay? Sorry that we didn't appreciate you. I love you. Bye. I love you too, Molly. Mom? Mom! Oh my gosh, I'm so happy to see you, Mom! Hey, Molly. I'm really proud of you guys for trying to help with the chores and understanding where I'm coming from. Mom, I missed you so, so much. <laughs> I really did miss you. Oh, I missed you girls so much too. I'm sorry I ran out. I just felt like I didn't get any help or any break. We promise, Mom, that we're gonna help more often. What do you help with? need help with today? Well, I sort of need help um, dusting and Sorry, you can't do that. I gotta go outside and play. Molly? Just kidding. <laughs> oh, I didn't sleep at all last night. Wait, is my wife back? Oh, honey, I missed you. I stink at cooking. I'm sorry. It's all right, honey. You can help me in other ways. Oh, wow, you didn't even shave today. That's because I didn't get a wink of sleep. I'm not used to sleeping without you in my room. Oh, I missed you all, too. Now, come on. Let's go to Grandma's house and pick up baby Kira. Mom, don't ever leave again, okay? Okay. As long as you guys promise to not take advantage of me. We promise! You have been a very naughty little demon baby. Don't put me in jail, please! I don't, I don't want to be in jail! Well... Too bad you're in jail. Maybe you should think next time about not being so evil. What? I'm not that evil. Let me out of here, lady. Let me out. Are you now going to have a temper tantrum? Are you serious? I am going to have a temper tantrum. I'm hungry and I'm sleepy and I don't want to be in baby jail. <laughs> well, I think a timeout for you, little demon, is absolutely necessary. You just wait. My sister and my best friend are going to get me out of here. You just wait! Molly, it makes me so sad that my sister is a demon. Well, get over it. I am a demon. I'm a troublemaker and a prankster. Molly, you wouldn't be stuck in baby jail if you could just be good like me. <coughs> I'm, not, I'm not feeling so good all this time on the inside. It's made me sick. Molly, just stop being naughty and having temper tantrums, pranking everybody and stuff, and you could be good like me. Hey guys, are we ready to play hide and seek? No, Bookie, I'm afraid that Molly has gone demon again. Well, get out! Why are you going in my bathroom? You can't be in here. You're an angel. You're not allowed to be in jail. I'm just using the bathroom for a minute. It'll only take a second. Get off my potty! Demons only! Oh, you're so grumpy. I can get out. Um, Molly, no. They made an invisible force field. You can't get out of there. What? They they really have locked me in? That's right, Molly. And we were going to play hide and seek today, too. I guess we'll have to play without you. Yeah, devil sister. You can't play because you're not good like we are. What? I can still play and I'll beat you guys. Okay, well... You have to make it to the safe zone, which is the kitchen, in two minutes. What? Well, okay. Just because I'm stuck in jail doesn't mean that I can't play hide and seek, too. Good luck, Molly. If you can't make it to the safe zone in two minutes, you can't play hide and seek for the rest of the day. That's the rules. I can make it to the safe zone. You just wait and see. Good luck, Molly. You're going to need it. Just because I'm a demon doesn't mean I can't play hide and seek too. I can make it to the safe zone. I totally can. Hmm. What could I do to get there? Hmm. I could break this bed. <sighs> Wait, what? Is that a hole to get out? OMG. <laughs> I'm going to get to the safe zone in two minutes for sure. If I can find my way through this prison down here. I actually think it's a sewer. Wait a minute, there's a ladder! Yes! I wonder where it goes up to. Took me outside the school! Cool! Alright, now I gotta just teleport back to the daycare. And I only have about 
30 seconds left to go. Come on, why can't I run any faster? Oh yeah, because I'm a toddler and my legs are really short. <laughs> All right, where's the kitchen? Where's the kitchen? Where's the kitchen? Sometimes I forget where I'm going. Oh wait, there it is. <laughs> Molly, how did you get here? Yeah, Molly, how'd you do it? Well, I sort of broke out of jail. <laughs> That's what us demon babies do best. <laughs> now let's play hide and seek. Um, okay, Molly, well, you're it. What? I don't want to be it. No. Come on, Molly, just be it the first time. Okay, well, here's the rules. You can only hide inside the daycare. I'm an angel, so I would never cheat. I'm an angel, so I'd never cheat. <laughs> okay, fine. I'm going to count to 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Molly, slow down. I need to actually hide. Okay, 1, 2, 3. Well, while I'm waiting, I might as well eat this delicious cake. Mm, so good. Ready or not, here I come. The demon always wins because evil always wins. Just kidding. Not always, but sometimes. Wait a minute, I think I just saw Brookie. Brookie, I found you! <laughs> You're it next. You'll probably never find Daisy. She's super good at hiding. And she's super good at being good, too, because she's an angel. Blah, 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 blah. But these doors are locked, so I can't go in there. Um, She has to hide inside the daycare. So let's see if I can find her. Okay, I can't go in there. Hmm, where could she be? I'm gonna find you, Daisy. It's a, if it's the last thing I do. Wait a minute. <laughs> Guys, do you see that? <laughs> see right here? <laughs> Daisy, I know where you are. No, you don't, Molly. You'll never find me. Yes, I did. <laughs> How'd you know? You cheated! No, your name was like um above you onto the stairs, so I could tell that you were down there. That is cheating! No, that's just bad hiding on your part. Okay, Brookie, it's your turn. Um, it's saying I'm sick right now, but I feel fine. You're sick because you're a demon. Why do you always have to say so many mean things to me? Just because I'm a demon doesn't mean that I'm a bad person. <laughs> Um, Molly, were you truly sad right there, or were you just lying? She's always lying. That's what demons do. Okay, guys, enough fighting. Go and hide, and I'll see if I can find you. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I want to get out of here. Then she'd never know where I was. <laughs> Six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Ready or not, here I come. <laughs> She'll never find me here. Maybe I should hide out here. I'm not really sure. Yeah, no, definitely in here. Ooh, I can use the x-ray machine. Fun. What kind of trouble can I get into? Oh, you know, the hospital staff can use this? That makes me angry! <laughs> I wanted to play with that! It's not even fair! <laughs> Molly! <laughs> there you are. I thought I heard you having a temper tantrum from a mile away. What? How'd you find me first? Because you are so loud when you're angry and have a tantrum. Oh, man. I'm a demon and it gave me away and I got caught. It's not fair. It's totally fair, Molly. You have to be quiet when you're playing hide and seek. I don't like this game. I don't like it. Whoa, Molly, don't be such a sore loser. I don't like you and I don't like Daisy and I don't like anybody. Molly, do you have to be a demon? I mean, it's hard being your friend when you're a demon. I don't care. It's, it's who I am. And if you don't love me like I am, then you're not really my friend. Oh, my 
my little demon, it sounds like you need a nap. I need a nap? Don't you dare pick me up and put me in my crib. Put me down! I'd rather go to baby jail than have a nap. Oh, you're definitely getting a nap. La, 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 la. Quit singing to me. I kind of like it. La, 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 la. Lady, stop singing to me. It's making me feel kind of happy, and I, I don't want to be happy. Oh, it looks like you need a bath, and then you'll be all nice and clean for your nap. I don't, I don't want a nap. Oh, these bubbles are kind of fun. Hey, we were playing hide-and-seek, lady. You can't just interrupt our hide-and-seek game. Come on now. It's time for a night-night. La, la, la. La, la, la. La, 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 la. Oh, man. I'm feeling super tired. This lady's good. She is good. No! I have to stay a demon. I have to. There you are, Molly. Oh, it's night-night time. Guess you lose at hide-and-seek. What? No, I don't. I don't lose. Uh, yeah, Marley, I think you actually do. I don't lose! I don't want to lose! Oh, yeah. She's a demon. Once a demon, always a demon. <laughs>
All right, girls. Again, if you have any problems, call me right away. We will, Mom. Bye. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm in charge. So you two go make me some popcorn. Molly, we're not going to be bossed around like that. Yeah, Molly. I can boss you around you can boss you Baby Kira, I can boss you around because A, I am your older sister, and B, I'm a lot bigger than you. Okay, I can make you something to eat. Good job, baby Kira. Good job. Ah, I knew having a little sister would pay off eventually. I make my something very good for snack. I get a turkey and I make it um, nice and clean for her. I put it in washing machine. <laughs> I, I go round, round, and round, and then I hit up in the dryer. I <laughs> she love his snack. Molly, do you smell that? It smells kind of like burning turkey. <laughs> well, Dad's not here and it's not Thanksgiving, so it can't be that. Are you running the dryer? Me? No, I never do my own laundry. Mom does it for me. And since she's not here, you could. Molly, where's baby Kira? I don't know. I better go check on her. What? <gasps> baby Kira, did you put turkey in the... In the Oh my gosh, Daisy, I need your help here. What is it, Molly? Oh, I'm going to miss this episode of Cops. Holy guacamole, you're no better than Grandma. Oh my gosh, she put turkey in the dryer. That definitely ruined it. Oh, who's explaining this to Mom, not me? Nope, nope, nope. I'm not explaining it. Oh, I wonder who that could be. Hello? Hey, Molly, I'm just checking in. <laughs> Hour one, done. If you girls are home alone, how's it going? I didn't buy turkey in the dryer. What did she say? Uh, she said, everything's great at home. You just keep on working, Mom. Talk to you later. Bye. Oh, boy. Let's get this mess cleaned up, baby Kira. Go get some paper towels. I can't play with towels and I have that. I do like your snack. Uh, yeah, I love my snack. Uh, what are you going to tell a three-year-old? Okay, baby Kira, it's time for your bath. You're a big girl now, so you go draw the water and get in the tub, okay? This is where I'm taking a bath. Oh, yeah. Molly, you cannot take a bath in the hot tub. You'll make bubbles everywhere. Oh, my gosh. My sister is so bossy. It's just a little bit of soap. I don't even know what she's talking about. Molly, you're going to ruin the hot tub. Oh, whatever. I'm not in charge of her. I'm just going to keep watching this cops episode. And if she gets grounded for life, not my problem. Wee! Get fun! Molly, have you checked on baby Kira in a while? What do I look like? Ugh. Why well, I gotta do everything around here? Well, you are the oldest. You said you were gonna watch everybody. Now all of a sudden you don't want the job. Baby Kira, you doing okay? Oh my gosh! She's taking a bath in the toilet! Ah! Baby Kira! Ah! Get out of there! I'm not touching her. She may have touched a poo-poo. Ew! Hello? Hey, Molly. Hour number two. How are things going at home? Um, perfect. I, I spice with doo-doo. Oh, yeah. Perfect, Mom. What did baby Kira just say? Um, she's so happy to, too. <laughs> Bye, Mom. Oh, boy. This has turned into quite the disaster. All right. Everybody in bed. I was already coming in here, Molly. I can't even deal with this anymore. I can't put my sack to sleep because Mama is singing me Night Night song. Okay, come on. I'll sing you the Night Night song. Come into your room. Come on. I'm crying, but at first I had to go poo poo. Oh, seriously? No, just kidding. <laughs> then get back here and go to bed. Sing this song. I'm not going to go to bed. Night, night, tucked in tight. See you in the morning light. Night, night, turn off the light. Go to sleep! That's not how it goes. Night, night, tucked in tight. See you in the morning light. Night, night, tucked in tight. See you in the morning light. You forgot the power. You got the power. Turn off the light. Okay, okay. Just stay calm. Who's knocking at the door? It's so late. Oh my gosh. Maybe it's a burglar. Wait a minute. They probably wouldn't knock at the door. Who could it be? 
Marley never answered the door when Mom's not home. But I have to know who it is. It could be, it could be like the sweepstakes and I've won a million dollars. <laughs> yeah, that'd be awesome. Grandma, what are you doing here? Oh, hello, honey. Your mom called me. She's going to be a little late. And she was a little worried about you. Jiminy Cricket, I can take care of myself and my sisters. Oh, really? She told me baby Kira was taking a, a bath in the toilet. How did she know that? Wait a minute. Mom, have you been spying on us? Mom! Sorry, Molly. Uh, it's just something parents do sometimes when we're super worried about you. You can talk to me through the security cams? Yeah, and I'm not quite sure you're ready for the responsibility of taking care of your little sister yet. Do you have a camera in like every room, Mom? Well, not every room, but quite a few of them. So I prefer it you stay here with Grandma. Oh, man! Don't worry, we can watch cops together. Oh, boy. Daisy, are you ready for this? I don't know, Molly. I don't know. I mean, we have to climb and climb and climb and climb. And it, it's, it's like going all the way to um, outer space. <laughs> yeah, it says stop climbing when you hear the clicking sound. Um, but look, we can deploy a saving rope. So, um, I'm hoping that like there's a parachute and some ropes and stuff in here. No, Molly, I'm pretty sure we're going to fall to our death. Uh, yeah, but look, Max from Stranger Things is in here. Oh, she looks so happy. Molly, I don't think that's Max from Stranger Things. Oh, uh, yeah, uh, probably not. Things didn't end so well for her. Definitely not. Hi, I'm so glad to be here. <laughs> I'm so excited. Whoa, she's like so excited to die. Yeah, because I'm sure we're all gonna die in this game. Uh, everybody's fighting to go up the ladder. Me first, me first. No, I'm going first. Ow, you pushed me. Whoa, guys, come on. Ow, you got, you made me fall on my butt. That was just rude. That was rude. Okay, me first. Oh, finally, I made it up the ladder. Ow! Oh my gosh, I just knocked somebody off the ladder. Ow! Oh, I fell on my head. Uh, Molly, you're not doing so good. Okay, I'm listening. Guys, every time I stop, it's because I hear like a... A sound like the ladder is literally gonna break in half. Oh no! <laughs> oh man! That time, I didn't pay attention to it. I just kept climbing. It's because this thing is so rusty. Like, this doesn't pass code. Not one little bit. Who are the grown-ups who made this? Ah, it fell on my head. Somebody call an ambulance. Oh, yeah. I stopped in time that time. Whoa, it's getting dark. Look at all the rungs. Ah! <laughs> I found my butt again. Maddie, I'm almost to the moon. Well, good for you, Daisy. All right, I'm just going to look up and see where Daisy is. OMG. I can't even see her anymore, guys. If you guys see me stop, it's because when you hear that sound, it's literally the creaking of the, the like, ladder. Oh, I, I went too soon. It was still creaking. Ow. Guys, quit pushing. Seriously. That girl's yawning. Oh, it's because it's so late. I'm just, ah, I'm so tired. Why don't you go home and like go to bed or something? Because I've been climbing this ladder all day and I just, I don't want to lose. Oh man, that guy's got a rope. Uh, deploy... Deploy rope. Oh, guys, look at it. Ah! Oh, man, I'm on my head now. Oh, that didn't work out so good. All right, let me try again. What? Okay, um, I need to disconnect this rope. <laughs> that is weird. This entire game, guys, is literally me climbing a ladder. Please subscribe, guys. Please slam the like button. Oh, 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 am 
I gonna make it? It's gonna creak again. I just know it. Oh, this is this is like a very come on now. Oh, this is like a very weird red light green light. Oh my gosh, you guys hear that? Oh, ow! You guys are pushing and shoving. All right, I need a private server. I'm climbing on the edge, and guys, even though there's a creaking sound. It doesn't seem to matter. <laughs> I found a glitch in this game. -na 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 -na. What's this remove? Oh, wow, guys. This is the highest I've ever gotten. Holy guacamole. I don't know why. Even when it creaks, I'm not dying. Oh, my gosh. I can see the entire world from up here. This is amazing. Ah! <laughs> oh my gosh. The Star Squad's in here. Oh my god, I'm a huge fan of yours. Ow. Well, don't watch me fail at this because I'm epically failing. Daisy's just stopped answering. I don't even know where Daisy is. I'm all the way to the top, Molly. You are? Seriously? Or maybe if I go on this angle again. All right, guys, I'm not taking any chances. Every time it creaks, guys, I stop. Um, Guys, would it be amazing if I made it all the way to the top of this ladder? Like, what happens if you make it all the way to the top? Do you get, like, an award or something? There's no survivors, Daisy. You're not at the top. Wait, did I just see her? I feel like she's lying to me about where she is. <gasps> there she is! Okay, yeah, she didn't make it to the top. You stinking liar, Daisy. Um, yeah, okay, well, whatever. Oh my god, I'm so afraid of heights. Bye, Daisy, see ya. D Daisy. Uh -huh. Oh, Molly, you're so rude. My face was right there. <laughs> That's one way to win. Just fart on the ladder. Daisy, you're gonna knock me down, stop. Molly, you stop. Seriously, if we're ever going to make it to the top of this, we have to stop when it creaks. Oh, uh, I think it's creaking because I ate too many cupcakes. And, um, I'm just a little too fat for this ladder. What's the weight limit on this thing? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Doing good so far. Oh, M, G. Guys, all right, look, it shows the meter over here of how far I've made it. Oh, well, people are just dying left and right. You see that person just fall? Ah! Ah! Oh, my God! Ah! Ah! Why did I fall? I didn't even feel like I did anything wrong. Okay, when they said this game was impossible, uh, they were totally right. Oh, my God, it's Molly! It's Daisy! There's the yawning girl again. Are you still tired? Oh, yeah, I'm so tired, but I'm not going to give up. All right, guys, if I could just make it halfway, I'd be so happy about this. All right, guys, let's do this. <laughs> this thing is so creaky, like, oh, MG. People are just dying left and right. Oh, my gosh. Wow, it's getting really creaky now that I'm at the top. I'm, like, afraid to move up here. Guys, look, somebody's name is Nobody. They don't even have a name. It's just kind of sad. You're not a nobody. You're a somebody. Believe in yourself. Guys, I'm farther than I've ever been before. 
I feel like this might not be impossible. Are those bats I keep seeing flying by? I don't like bats! Alright guys, here we go. Daisy? Uh, Molly, I'm just hanging around. Oh, Daisy, are you stuck? Uh, ah, Molly, you're dying! Ah! Oh, 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 oh. Oh, yeah. That was definitely a brain injury. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Hey, guys. Okay, so now we're in a different fall game. And this one, basically, you have to reach the top of the tower before it collapses. Climbing makes you lose your energy by gaining it back um, after every ladder you go up. So, you better move fast. Um, okay. <laughs> Molly, I don't know. You think we're going to be able to do this? Yeah, this is going to be a piece of cake. Wait, why am I inside this house? That's just kind of creepy. Is Oh, there's a picture of me. This must be my house. Yeah, because I wouldn't have a picture of you. Hey! Why not? I'm your sister. Don't you want to have a picture of me? Absolutely not. Don't remind me that you're my sister. Ooh, what am I eating at my house? Um, woo, Fruit Loops. Are we gonna climb this or not? Oh yeah, uh, okay, I'm coming. I have a really nice house, but I need some furniture. All right, guys, I went into the wrong room. Um, okay, I, this is the first time I've been here, and apparently also it's Christmas. How do we get out of this house now? Ah, it's like a big circle. I think this is the way I came in. No, that's the bedroom. Dizzy, I'm stuck in this house forever. Like, literally, I don't know how to get out. Oh, now I'm in the bathroom, and someone is pooping upside down. Oh, my gosh, Molly, she's drowning in toilet water. Oh, ew. Okay, I don't know how to help you here. Um, uh, yeah, okay, I'm sorry. I don't know how to help you. <laughs> Molly, follow me, cheapest creepers. I can't believe there's somebody in the toilet water in there. Maybe they're, like, taking a bath. I don't think so, Molly. I don't think so. All right, where's this tower? Is this it? The climbing tower over here? No, Molly, you gotta drive there. Duh. Okay, I've got a cool car. Whoa. Do I know how to drive? It doesn't matter, Molly. It's just a teleporter. Oh, okay, here we go. Um... O-M-G. Look at this tower. I can't even see the top of it. Daisy, no cheating. Ah, uh, I'm not cheating if they offer something I can buy. Here we go. All right. Um, It will collapse in 400 and 540, like, three seconds. So I just got to climb, 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 climb. All right, I'm doing pretty good. There's some people ahead of me, but... Oh, man, they're not doing so good. <laughs> oh, people are dying left and right. Because my energy is, like, going to get lower and lower and lower. I'm trying not to let it, though. Seriously. Because I ate a cupcake, so I should have the most energy of everyone here. Um, Guys, I'm really sorry. But I kind of have to fart. <laughs> oh, Molly, that's gross. Sorry, uh, different ca camera angle. Daisy, you're beating me? Yep, totally. Daisy, you sort of beat me at every Roblox game there ever was. Guys, look at this. Um, I can see clouds. We're like up in the clouds. Just keep climbing, climbing, climbing. Climbing, 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 climbing. Uh, Daisy, I think we might actually make it to the top of this one, which is better than the other game because um, there was, it was impossible. You literally could not make it to the top of that one. But this one, this one's a different story. Molly, maybe she was drinking the toilet water. I didn't see a Coke machine around here anywhere. And doing all this climbing sure does make you thirsty. Oh my gosh. Look at this, Daisy. We made it. Wait, are we supposed to climb up this over here? Oh God, we didn't make it. Better keep climbing, Molly. There's a lot of climbing to do. Oh my gosh. How much climbing do they want us to do? Well, it's not called climb, it's called fall, which I feel like is just setting us up for failure. Yeah, that's like your teacher giving you a test and writing an F on it before you even answer the questions. Oh yeah, true that, Molly, true that. Oh, come on. There better not be another tower after this one. I'm losing my energy. I'm losing my energy. 
Marley, maybe you could um, have a cupcake. I don't have a cupcake. I wish I did. I wish I did. Whoa, why am I going back down? Don't go down. Don't choose down. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. Marley, we still have 400 seconds before it collapses. That's like four minutes. Yeah, but my energy keeps running out. What will I do then? Um, I don't know. You can't buy a snack or anything. <sighs> okay. Well, I think your energy goes up, it said, every single ladder you climb. So, if I can make it to the top of this quick enough, my energy should go up and I won't die. That's wishful thinking, Molly. Where's my sister? Oh, I, got, I can't stop climbing. I gotta climb really fast. Oh, God, my energy's going down. Am I gonna make it to the top, guys? I don't know. I really don't know. My energy's at 24, 23, 22. Oh, no. I'm starting to fade. I'm fading, you guys. Oh, gosh. Oh. Oh. Wait, did my energy go up? All right, it's going up, guys. This is good news. But I'm not done making it to the top of the, the ladder yet. Molly, you have to wait till your energy goes up. I know. Tell me about it. Um, But let's see where I am because I don't see where I am on the list. Oh, it says we have zero success. That's not good. All right, let's do this. Let's keep climbing. I'm always climbing. I'm always climbing. This is the longest video of me climbing a ladder that I've ever made for YouTube. Guys, I have made like, I think like 5,000 videos for YouTube. Can you guys believe that? Slam that like button if you think that's amazing. And guys, I have never climbed a ladder this tall for this long in any of those 5,000 videos before. So you've seen it here first, guys. This is, this is crazy. Um, guys, I really think this is the top of the ladder. And my energy is really bad. Maybe I should have waited longer at the bottom. I don't know. Come on, Molly. You can do this. Oh, my gosh. I hope so. This girl ahead of me is a Star Squad fan, and she's like, come on. You can do this. I'm like, all right. I'm trying my best. I'm trying. Molly, uh, I think you're climbing down the ladder. Don't do that. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. My sister must be below me, but I can't look down there to see. Yeah, all I see is your butt as you climb up the ladder, Molly. <laughs> Do not fart, Molly. No promises. No promises. Oh my gosh, guys. My energy's at nine. No. Wait, if I stop, will it just... Oh god, it keeps going down. Guys, I'm not going to make it to the top before I die. Okay, I just fail. I fail at these games. That's why they're called fall. And I'm about to die in... One second. Ah! Ah! Oh my god, I had to start back at the bottom? That was way! <laughs> Molly, Molly. Okay, let's spectate my sister. Because I want to see if she actually made it all the way to the top. Daisy? Are you okay? Uh, Molly, do you see where I am right now? Whoa, Daisy, you're like almost in outer space. Uh, I hate to break this to you, but there's a zombie behind you. What? Are you serious? Brains. Eat your brains. I love them. Ah! Oh my gosh. Oh, uh, well, I better keep climbing. I hope your energy's okay, Daisy, because she is climbing right behind you. Did you see that? Oh, wow, Daisy, that's, that's... Oh my God, it's coming back to bite you again! Ah! This is insane, Molly, the eagle's trying to kill me! Uh, Daisy, just keep climbing. Climb fast, climb faster, Daisy. Oh yeah, she's she's a goner. Who said there was gonna be eagles up here to kill us? That's just wrong. Uh, yeah, sorry about that, Daisy. Um, but it looks like you're gonna die. Oh man, the zombie's even beating you. That's because she can't die. That's not even fail. <laughs> yeah, that is kind of unfair. I have to admit. Oh, Daisy, I think you I think you figured it out. I hope so, Molly, because this this eagle, the hawk, or whatever it is. I don't know. Let me look at it. I actually think it's a hawk, Daisy. I don't think it's an eagle. It's hard to see, but maybe a falcon or something. 
Oh, uh, uh, owl, I don't know. It's just trying to kill me. The psycho killer owl. Oh, man. Psycho killer owl. No, I think it is a hawk. I can't see. It's just evil. It's one big evil bird. Daisy, what's happening? Um, I'm trying to go on the other side of the ladder. So, ah! Uh, Daisy, I think it's safe to say that that didn't work out for you. Oh, my gosh, Daisy! Holy guacamole, Daisy. Daisy? Oh, my gosh. Th 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 there's a helicopter up here, and it's shooting at me. Ah, uh, this game gets crazier and crazier, guys. Ah, uh, Daisy? What do you think of this game? I think I wasted 20 minutes of my life. <laughs> oh, come on, Daisy. It was pretty fun. It was crazy. Totally. <laughs> hey, guys. Thanks for watching us die a million times at this. You're the best fans ever. We love you. Bye. Bye, guys. You guys look so adorable for our field trip today. Now, I want to tell you a few rules. Okay, what are they, teacher? Ow, could you stop roller skating on my head? Rude! Um, can you please go over there? I Okay, thank you. Uh, she didn't realize that um, we weren't ready to go to the fun house yet. So she was just, you know, she's one of the chaperones. She's very excited. Yeah, okay, but what are the things we have to know as rules? Because I'll probably break all of them. Marley, if you break them, you'll never be allowed to go on a field trip ever again. Where's everybody else? Well, they're with their chaperones, and you guys are with me. So, today I want to tell you... Brittany, I have a question! Molly, please. I need to tell you how you're going to remain safe as a class. Everyone has a chaperone. You and Daisy have me, Brittany, as a chaperone. You should check in with me every half an hour. Every half an hour. Okay. Um, what else? You should always stay inside the fun house. Never talk to strangers. We want you to be safe on your field trip. And lastly, have tons of fun. You guys are going to have a blast today at the new Twilight Daycare Fun House. I can't wait, Whitney, but will my friend Brookie be there? Of course she will. She just has a different chaperone. At least we didn't get Darla. Look at her over there. She's so grumpy looking. Yeah, really. I hope Brookie didn't get Darla. Actually, Brookie did get Darla. Ugh, poor best friend. Oh man, she's gonna have the worst field trip ever. Wow, Molly, look at this place. I know, it looks amazing. Come on, let's go inside. Come on, girls, now remember the rules. You must check in with me every half an hour. No going outside the fun house and don't talk to strangers. And have fun, got it. Come on, Daisy. I'm looking for Plucky. Well, she'll catch up with us. Oh my gosh, this looks like so much fun. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ow, Molly, you made that run into me, rude. <laughs> OMG, look at this slide. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> it goes down into a giant ball pit. Ow, that kind of hurt. Daisy, you're the only kid I know that comes to the fun house and doesn't have any fun. I think I'd rather just be studying. Oh my gosh, Daisy. Lighten up. Have some fun. This is the good times. Wee. <laughs> Marty, I think Blookie's getting healed. Okay, well, I'll go meet her at the door. Whoa. <laughs> OMG, that was so fun. Okay, I don't see Brookie. Where is she? I'm just going to go outside here for a minute and take a look and see if I can find her. Brookie? Brookie? Well, hello there. You must be having a great time at the fun house today. Huh? What? Who, who are you? Oh, <laughs> I just got a job at the fun house, so, you know, I work here. Oh, well, um, uh, okay, what did my teacher say again? Um, uh, uh, oh yeah, don't talk to strangers. Sorry, but I can't talk to you. And also, I have to go potty. Well, I've got a potty inside the fun house, but you could use the back entrance. Oh, really? That's really nice of you. I guess I could trust you. Follow me. <laughs> okay. Well, I really have to go poo-poo. This doesn't look like a back door to the fun house. What's going on? What's going on is, <laughs> now you're my prisoner. Hey, pull me down. What are you doing? 
<laughs> you're a famous YouTuber. You're worth a lot of money. I'm guessing that your parents at Twilight Daycare will pay a lot of money to get you back. And of course, if they don't, well, I'll just throw you to the fishes. Wait, what? No! Oh my god, why they attack the strangers? Now don't move, or else. Well, I can't swim, so there's no problem with me moving. But you don't know how to do this. I mean, wait, what's your name? Bad dude. That's not your real name. Actually, I'm not telling you my real name. But you can just call me Bad Dude. Bad Dude, come on. I, I, I don't want to be kidnapped. Well, if they pay the ransom, then you can get away. Oh, no. This is the worst day of my life. Hey, look, there's Plucky. Hi, Plucky. <laughs> Daisy. Whoa, Plucky, what's wrong? I, I, I just saw Molly get kidnapped. What? Are you kidding me? My sister? Yeah, and, and also, I really have to go poop. Oh, well, um, maybe we should worry about that first. No, we should definitely go get Molly. I'll hold it. Besides, I'm wearing a pull-up. Okay, where did you see her get kidnapped to? She's on a, bo a boat, I think, out in the ocean. Well, I can't swim too good, so that won't be any help. I can swim, but first we gotta figure out what he wants. What does he want with our friend? Well, like I said, I can't swim, so I don't know what I'm going to do, Plucky. Well, I have an idea. You go to the police, and I'll swim out and see if I can rescue Molly. That's a crazy idea! Are you insane? You're a toddler! You can't rescue her from a kidnapper! Duh! I can't lose my sister and my best friend! Well, it's the only choice I think we have. I'll find out what the kidnapper wants, and try to convince him that we're going to give it to him. You go get the police. I don't think this is a good idea, but Pookie, let's work together. Okay, good luck, Daisy. Good luck, Pookie. Nobody knows the trouble I've seen. Please stop singing and dancing. You're so annoying. <laughs> yeah, right. I'm like the world's best singer and dancer. No, seriously, you're not. You're not. Whatever. I know you love my singing and dancing. Oh, I hope someone comes to pay your ransom soon. Well, maybe you should s tell them what the ransom is. I mean, you're just floating around out here. And I'm hungry! Brookie? Well, what are you doing here? I'm swimming out to save you. Ha <laughs> ha, save her. What do you want to get my friend back? I want a million dollars. Whoa, you think I have that kind of money because I'm famous? I think you do. Um, well, you're sadly mistaken. <laughs> I'm not even 18 yet. I hardly have any money. And the money I do have, I spent all on cupcakes at Starbucks. And they were delicious. Molly, I don't think this guy is, is well, totally sane. I heard that. He's a few cookies short of a picnic. A few crayons short of a box. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Hold it right there, criminal. Ha ha ha. Looks like my best friend called the cops. What? I don't... Hey! Get, get out of here! Yeah, yeah! I don't want to go to jail! Well, looks like you are, and you're not getting your million dollar ransom either. Wait a minute. Is that cop blowing bubbles at me? <laughs> you're not going anywhere. And now I'm kidnapping your friend, too. What? No! I have to do my homework! Hey, you can't just take these kids. I, I, I'll get a taser after you. Well, um... I don't like tasers, but all you have is a toy gun. This isn't a toy. I'm a cop. Now give me those children. Now. Fine. But this isn't the last you've heard of me. Yes, it is. Because I'll never talk to strangers ever again. Come on, Molly. Let's go back to shore. I'm not a very good swimmer. Here, um, use this giant unicorn raft. It'll make it easier for you. Brookie, you really are my best friend. Thanks for rescuing me. You have to give some credit to Daisy, too. She literally went to the cops and got them to come here and, like, believe her that, um, that you were being kidnapped. Wow. I can't believe my teacher was right. Never, ever talk to strangers and stay with the class. And also, I need to, uh, go pee pee. Do you think it's wrong if I pee in the ocean? Um, I don't think the sharks or whales will mind. <laughs> Well, sorry about that.
the sharks and whales. <laughs>be molly and daisy molly you didn't wear your scrubs welcome to your internship are you both excited to be here i am i think i'm gonna be great at this summer internship uh i'm not really that excited oh well why did you take this internship then molly uh because my teacher said that if i didn't want to have detention for the entire summer uh i needed to do this internship really molly that's the only reason yeah, pretty much. Well, I have some exciting news. You guys are going to be helping us in the maternity ward, taking care of these adorable babies that have just been born. That sounds ad adorable and amazing. Seriously? I didn't sign up for this. Lots of pooping and diapers and throw up and ugh. This sounds like a horrible internship. I would have rather had one at Dunkin' Donuts. That way I could have eaten free donuts all day long. Molly, that's all you think about is your stomach. Trust me, these babies are so adorable. You're not gonna mind changing those poopy diapers, Molly. Speak for yourself, lady. That sounds gross, disgusting, and, and, and yucky. Well, why don't we get started, guys? Wait, Molly, you definitely need a pair of scrubs. I'll go get you some. Perfect, now you're all set. These are itchy, ah, uh, ah, uh, they're itching me. Molly, uh, you're so annoying. Sometimes I wonder how I even got stuck with her as a sister. Okay, girls, follow me and I'll take you right to the nursery. We have so many adorable babies right now. Yeah, super adorable crying little monsters, I bet. Oh, look at them all. So cute! Oh, I want to hold this one. See, Molly? Maybe this internship is for you after all. Here you go, lady! This thing's crying! Of course she is. She's a baby. Watch this. La la la. What's that smell? Wee, wee. It's your first day on the job and your first poopy diaper, Molly. Have fun. I've got to go see patients. Bye. Daisy, you take this baby. No, she's full of doo-doo. I've got my own babies to take care of. Okay. Ugh. All right. La, 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 la. La, la, la. laugh that's awesome okay let's change your diaper and i'm gonna put you right back to bed oh look at this little baby it says her name is amanda amanda wait a minute this baby looks a lot like amanda the adventurer well i i i think anyway <laughs> Molly, that's funny. Amanda the Adventurer is A, much older than this baby, and B, a video game and not real. But her face, it, it, it looks just like Amanda, and, and her name is Amanda. Maybe somehow she's turned back the hands of time and, and, and became a baby. I think she's adorable. Oh, I see you girls have met the little baby Amanda. Sad story, she's an orphan. Wait, what? Yeah, we don't know who her parents are. I guess nobody wanted her. I can't understand why, isn't she adorable? I think she is. Daisy, don't you dare pick up that baby. What? Why wouldn't I? She's so cute. Hi, Amanda. I'm Daisy, nice to meet you. I did a boy da, I did a boy da. Oh, look. She's totally harmless, Molly. Do you think that your mom and dad would be okay if Amanda stayed with you for a few nights? She's been going home with me in the evening since she's not adopted yet, but I could use a break. I've been pulling a lot of all-nighters. Uh, the answer is no, absolutely not, and can't do it, no way, nada. Molly, of course we could. Mom loves babies, and we take especially good care of her. Aww. Great! Then I'll send her home with you until we find an adoptive mom or dad. 
Um, uh, uh. Mr. Giggles, I had to do this horrible internship today and it wasn't any fun. Oh, hi, Molly. I see you're telling Mr. Giggles about your day. You've been doing that since you were born, practically. You love that stuffed monkey. I really do. Mom, um, uh, so I sort of brought home some homework. You know, I'm pretty much an overachiever in everything. Why are you holding a baby from the hospital, Daisy? It's an orphan. Her name is Amanda. And the doctor asked if we could take care of her as a family for a couple of nights. Wait, what? You nominated us, Daisy? Uh, well, uh, it's been a while since I've had a newborn in the house. Yeah, tell me about it. Considering she's the Amanda the Adventurer from that evil, evil video game, I thought it was a bad idea, too. And he stopped saying that she is not. Holy guacamole, she's so rude. Well, I guess we could watch her for a few nights. That is, until she's adopted. Mom, send her back! She's evil! Oh, hi, little sweetheart. Yeah, Molly, we're evil. She's like the sweetest baby ever. Okay, girls, why don't you go ahead and change out of your scrubs and into your pajamas? It's getting late. Come on, Mr. Giggles. You're the only one that understands me. Ah, man, that internship really wore me out. Good night, Daisy. Good night, Molly. Don't forget to say good night to Mr. Giggles. Good night, Mr. Giggles. When are you going to let that stuffed animal go? It's been a, a long time since you've owned that. You're like a big kid now. You don't need a stuffed animal. Be quiet. Mr. Giggles will be with me always and forever. Now, good night, Daisy. That was an awesome night's sleep. Right, Mr. Giggles? Mr. Giggles? Mr. Giggles? Molly, do you have to be so loud in the morning? Oh, I just woke up, but I haven't had any coffee yet. Daisy, Mr. Giggles is missing. I always say good morning to him, and he's not in my bed. Maybe he fell behind the bed. You do roll around a lot in your sleep. Yeah, good point. No, he's not back there that evil Amanda the Adventurer baby. She probably took him. Molly, Amanda is a newborn. How would she take your Mr. Giggles stuffed monkey? She's just a baby. I don't know, but she's evil, I say. She's evil. Good morning, Molly. Mom, that Amanda girl, she has to get out of here. You mean the newborn that's still sleeping? What are you talking about? She stole Mr. Giggles. Molly, a newborn can't steal Mr. Giggles. Why does nobody believe me? That looks just like Amanda the Adventurer. She probably killed her woolly stuffed animal, and now she's after Mr. Giggles. And he's my best friend. Molly, oh my goodness. I don't know why you're so obsessed with this Amanda the Adventurer game, but I'm telling you, that baby Amanda has nothing to do with it. Now go eat your waffles. Molly, the waffles are still in the oven. What's, what's that smell? It smells like something's burning. There is something burning in the oven. Maybe maybe it's the waffles. Is, is that, is that Mr. Giggles in the oven? Ah, how'd he get in there? Don't worry, Molly. Just, just pull him out and I'll spray him with the fire extinguisher. Mr. Giggles, don't worry, we're rescuing you. Oh man, he's got a big hole in him now. I've had this since I was a baby. He's, he's ruined. <laughs> oh my goodness. Who would put Mr. Giggles in the oven? Daisy, did you do this? What? No, I'm the good daughter. I would never do something like that. Even though Molly is the most annoying sister ever. <laughs> I'm just saying I would never do something so cruel, Mom. Well, somebody put Mr. Giggles in the oven. Don't worry, Molly. I can sew the hole back together. He'll never be the same. <laughs> He'll never be the same. But you'll still love him the same. Now, who could have done this? It was that baby. It was that evil baby. I have a good idea to find out who did this to Mr. Giggles. You do? What? 
Molly, it's okay, honey. I'm gonna fi fix Mr. Giggles. But in the meantime, let's look at our security cameras. Wait, you have security cameras? Yeah, of course we do, in case somebody breaks in. Yeah, let's figure this out, Mom. I bet it was Amanda. Molly, Amanda is a newborn. We've go gone over this. But it wasn't Daisy, so who could it have been? <laughs> Oh my gosh, it is Amanda the Adventurer. How did it get to be a baby? I don't know, but that was the creepiest thing I've ever seen. Oh my gosh, we have to take that baby back to the hospital right now. Come on, we'll get her and we'll take her right back to the hospital where she came from. Okay, Mom. Wait, Mom? Where's Amanda? She was... She was here. I, I put her to sleep and, and I just checked on her this morning, not that long ago. Oh my God, she's escaped into Brookhaven. And she probably wants to kill us all. Is she under the bed? Mom, no, she escaped. Did you not catch that? She probably wants to kill us all. Oh my gosh. Oh, I can't believe this. An evil baby is a psycho and on the loose. Yep. This is how the story ends. Well, no, not really, because, you know, you still have Mr. Giggles, even if he does have a hole in him now. Mr. Giggles, I'm sorry. I'm sorry this happened to you. I, I love you anyway, though, even though you're a little charred from being in the oven. Molly, we have to stop this Amanda the Adventurer before it's too late.